Pop Steve's here, and today I'm working on a new structure. This is a very large structure, and this is currently the base of my new structure. Quite large, and it's gonna get big. Now I've uh, added the feature of these uh, four digit seven segment displays. Um, when I click this button, adds one to the total. Right, donkey? Each time I press the button, numbers increment. Now, I'm going to use these numbers to illustrate my total number of subscribers. And my way of just saying thank you. Now, I have to get up this structure somehow. Again, this is just the base. Everything's going to be up there. And somehow I got to figure out a way to get from down here to up there. <laughs> Come up with this hidden stair idea. It's an old idea. But what I've done is different segments of stairs show up one by one allowing you to get up to the top of this base. Now, in case you haven't uh, seen this before uh, I'm sure anybody that's played with stairs have discovered this feature that uh, you can make corner stairs with your stairs. Now, if we take a sticky piston, place it right behind that corner stair, power this sticky piston, use a lever, activate it, and the stair will appear on the outside. And we turn it off, goes back to being a corner stair, and fills in the wall. No stair, no stair. So that's basically what I got going here, except for I have multiple stairs in a row. But not only multiple stairs, I have multiple segments allowing me to back and forth up to the top, reach the top of my base. Now to achieve this, it's Basically the same as the uh, seven segment displays. I'm using a piston feed tape, the redstone block, but as the redstone block travels around the piston feed tape, it triggers the different segments of stairs uh, to get up to the top, one by one. At this end, we got the exact same thing, except I had to reverse it. Since how this is the way to get down, or the downstairs. This time, when we press our button, the stairs at the top show up first. And they cycle down just the same. Each segment lighting up as you need stairs to be there. Down you come. When I'm not using my stairs, they sink flush into the wall and are totally hidden. Now, this structure is going to get big. Like I said, this is just the base. We'll be putting multiple tiers on top of this. I'm going to add a few farms. Total space is 60 blocks by 60 blocks, thereabouts. Oh, one more thing with my stairs. I uh, probably don't have to tell you this, but I will anyways. If you stop halfway through, uh, you'll fall to the bottom. Now, yeah, you could make this a little more interesting and put a bed of lava at the bottom and make your stairs a little uh, more tense going up and down. Uh, possibilities are endless. 
Yeah, let's get back up to the top. A little big. Up we go. Does you need stairs? The stairs appear. There we go. Now this entire area will be covered. And I'll fill this in. 60 by 60, roughly 3,600 blocks <laughs> will do the job. And I, I got this hill in the middle of it. I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet. Uh, I have got the outline in, but I haven't done the back walls yet. A little more terraforming to do down there and fill in some low spots. Not sure if I'm going to shave the top of this hill off or leave it in there as part of my structure. I will deal with that later. You know, a lot of potential. A lot of terraforming to do. Exploring to do, too. And continue with our tiered lawns down here. Bring that cobblestone wall around and fill in the uh, levels with uh, dirt. I'm going to build something over there. I'm not sure yet. Maybe like a big lighthouse or something. I don't know. That's the future. I'm working on this project right now. Oh, there's a village. Anyways, back, back to this project on hand. Done a lot of work. Got a lot of riggings going. This is all underground. We'll eventually get covered all. Nobody will see it. More or less building a tribute to my subscribers. These feed tapes are certainly interesting, the things we can do with them. I still got a lot of different ideas. I'll bring up some more in the future. It does look complicated. <laughs> well, I got my work cut out for me. This is that same world I've started every other video in. And it's midday. I got a lot of work to do. I best get at it. This is Papa Steve's signing off.